Okay, welcome back. Uh, so, last episode, uh, we discovered that we were dragonborn, and um, we killed a dragon. This episode, we, uh, and we also got to how Iver said, this episode, we are gonna go up that motherfucking mountain. Right there. So, I'm Pasta Priest. Uh, my guests, introduce yourselves. I'm Garvin. Hi, I'm Onyx. Hi, I'm Syke. We've got a new guest today. Uh I wonder if there I'm are the actually any real ghosts at the nearby barrel. <laughs> Can you believe people get awesome. such things? We have different categories of it. Of anything. Mm. <laughs> so, let's head up that Does mountain. Does that make me the horny one? Yes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yep. I'm, the con I'm chaotic confused. Gloudy is the Texan. Carbon is... The brain. Carbon. Carbon. Not today. I'm, just not I'm the brain! Oh no, we're doomed. <laughs> <laughs> Just as long as I'm not the tactician. Psych Carbon and I have a combined IQ of like three. <laughs> That's being generous. <laughs> One and a half. Yeah, that's more like that. that might be closer. Hey, as long as you're not calling me the rent, then uh, some other word that I'm not going to use because I'm going to keep it in mind. Don't want this video demonetized. It's kind of an understanding between yeah, us. like these videos get money anyway. Charge them for a bit of preserved food. <clears throat> Trouble is, God damn it. Used to be. Climbing to I've done it again. Steps takes its toll. I tried to take a sip of my drink. I mean, and if we want to, that was. If we want to get a video demonetized, all you need to do is start talking about the Leopard or Two workshop. Why? <laughs> oh but... yeah, we got we we gave the tank a fucking. Uh, a nice theme song. It's very pleasant. No, 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 no. Um, Not those mods. I'm talking about... Ah, uh, yes, the nudity mod. You've mod. seen the workshop. Yeah. <laughs> yes, we, we the know. Only, We're the playing a game with an equally uh, volatile Sky. modding. Hmm. Anyway, I could do it for you. Really? Well, that would be kind of you. Here. Skyrim horny edition. At the top of the steps, you mean Skyrim? Wild. Just leave the bag inside. Yeah, that is just done. Skyrim. Until next time. Let's climb those steps. I, I need to stop putting Thanks. things oh. in cups because um, I, I put I put all ten sausages in a cup so that I could use a fork <laughs> to pull them out. And I went to go get a drink and I accidentally swall almost swallowed a sausage. <laughs> that was not intended. <laughs> Well, you were saying earlier that you are going to try doing um, solids as a drink. So oh, no, I, it wasn't that I was trying to; it's that I already had by accident. You'd be amazed how many things I accidentally tried to drink that weren't drinks. That makes me very concerned. God, if a bear gave you that much trouble, I fucking hate to see what the frost troll's gonna do. Uh, well, I, I wanted to I wanted to use the wolfos because he's a cool dude. Out of the context of the video. <laughs> just, just just imagine that out of the context of the video, where that one sentence trailed off and led into that next oh, sentence. I, I mean, everyone knows the fucking frost troll in Skyrim on the fucking steps. Fuck that fucking again. thing. If my lag's even oh yeah, let's just chase level ten character against like one of the fucking most dangerous enemies in the game. That's fair. Fuck you, Todd. Fucking asshole. Hack. It just works. It just works. It just works. I'm gonna take your word for it. This is only my second experience with Skyrim. <laughs> now I. Oh god, I just thought of a cursed the title for this video. Well, quiet casting. The Skyrim job. Are you gonna go for that, uh, stupid enchanting table thing in Dragon's Reach? Dragon's Reach? What do you mean? Uh, where you can enchant items to give you, like, 30,000% more health. Oh! <laughs> um... Oh, wow. I have the, uh, unofficial patch, so I can't do that. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh. Oh, that means they removed the fucking chest in Dawnstar, too. Yes. You can oh, that's right. The there rock. was some... Yeah, because someone at Bethesda was like, oh, we'll just throw the trader's inventory under this rock. Nobody will look here. 
And like within a week, someone fucking found it. And they hadn't fixed it since, I don't think. No, yeah, it's still not fixed. It's still in the game. Jesus Christ. Even better is you can take all the items and then go to that trader and sell their items back to them. Yes! That's the best part. <laughs> Uh, another and then go to the chest in Minecraft, and steal all the gold. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, it's kind of like what I do in Minecraft. Whenever I try and trade with the farmers, I always go steal their crops, and then I trade what they are growing back to them. A white wolfos. <laughs> it's just dead immediately. And a frost shout, or frost howl, or whatever. There's a. Uh... I think we were talking about treasure chests just before this. Oh, yes, yes, please. Talk about the thing that you wanted to talk about. Yes. Right. It's, yes, well, I don't think in Skyrim there's any mimics, but, um, I guess. Oh, shit, I'm not sure how to lead into this. Just start talking. Okay, well, basically, yeah, um, the idea is that, like, when thinking about mimics, like, I guess... Everybody associates mimics with treasure chests, and so in the games that do have mimics like that, that's one of the forms they take the form of. But you never see small mimics. And so you gotta wonder, because like all those mimics leave behind some amount of gold or treasure or whatnot, or they're defending something. And when you sometimes maybe mimics aren't obvious. You open up a treasure chest, maybe that is a mimic. But it's full of treasure. You'd never know. And so I guess... What happens to the slow mimics? Are, are they just kind of elsewhere? Or perhaps they're inside the treasure? They, they might be the treasure. <laughs> you got like the... Uh, you got the gold coins and stuff. But that stuff. Some of that might be real. Some of it might not be. Psych? So, please never DM. <laughs> <laughs> he told me see. this. He told me this, see, and this I was like, "Create a plague of mimics." Thank you. This I... is how you create a plague of mimics. The uh... adventurers they take that treasure and they use it to buy things. And some of those coins that they use to buy might be mimic. Mimic babies. Yes. And so they're just getting spread around the entire economy. I love this idea, by the way. <laughs> this is a fantastic I love, idea. I love the idea from a world building perspective, but please never do it on real players. <laughs> I'm a DM, I can do whatever I want. They have enough paranoia dealing with rules as written mimics. <laughs> Sorry, I just really like mimics. They're awesome. What's up with That's rules cool. written mimics? Uh, anything could be one. Mm, yeah. Yeah, that, that, that pretty much follows my own rules. Oh, wait. here comes okay, the troll. If that's, if that's the case, then does that mean that even the player itself could be a mimic? Hypothetically, yeah, so the player would probably know that they're a mimic. Not those are probably cool, like, that unless they don't know. Like, Start buffing. or like if they didn't know that they were part mimic. It, uh, well, that implies that somebody fucked a mimic. Onyx. Onyx. Oh, oh, get fucked, Frost Troll! Get destroyed! <laughs> Let me say, wouldn't that be Synchronized tea bag with me and Sophia. <laughs> <laughs> It's a dance at this realized, point. Moving a foot forward, this would be a very strange sight. <laughs> it would be teabagging. That was the yeah. point. Well, you're not gonna team fight somebody. No, no, I almost grabbed the. Cup uh, it's spot. not. It wasn't a re-release. It was. It's just a uh, free DLC, essentially. Okay, but they're still selling. Well, not selling, but releasing the same game. Another time. They want more people to play it. They want everyone in the world to play it, even though everyone in the world I'm is on fucking playing deathbed. it. I better be able to play fucking Skyrim on the goddamn like <laughs> IV or something. I believe this is just FIFA. 
<laughs> at the uh, but Todd's vision is the afterlife is Skyrim. <laughs> I'm not sure what's going to be the afterlife. The mystery of life. I don't know. I think Skyrim has gotten more re uh, more re releases than GTA 5 so far. Because GTA 5 has only been re released three times. three times. Skyrim has been five, I think. Wait, Original, GTA legendary. Has been re released? Yep. Yeah, first in 2013, wow. then again in 2014. Technically, you could count the PC release. I don't want to. Uh, and then, again, in what is to be 2022. Oh, wow. <laughs> you drink your sausage again? Mimic! What? <laughs> mimic. He drank a mimic. <laughs> oh, no. Please do not stick well, to we made it here alive, at least. This place I think we've huge. talked about that before. Yeah. yeah. Uh, hello, YouTube. This is a running joke. Uh, they're quoting me. I won't give you any more context. <laughs> I remember you also talked about the tea. Yes. I will. I will at least give a slight bit of context and say that that was instigated it's by me. the ones who built it on the highest mountain should in Skyrim we, of all places. Should we go up through uh, the quotes? Should we take it um, further and admit that I'm the one who actually found the hentai of someone using a cup of coffee like that? Uh, <laughs> oh right, that. Oh, oh right, animate nat of it exists. Oh. <laughs> hey kids, you should look up animate and animate. No, Please don't do that. Don't. don't, do that. <laughs> don't. I, I prefer to keep my image of mimics pure. Her door. Remember, we're idiots. Don't take our advice. Oh. Yeah. Well, take advice when we say don't do something. But... Well, it depends on which advice we're talking about. That's a good point. There's context. For instance, if another you say friend. don't. Yeah, well, yesterday we were talking about drinking and driving, and then you said don't take our advice because we're idiots. Yeah, yeah, that was that, that was a joke. Dragon Lord, it is you. That that was was that was Welcome the the funny Jake. Uh, anyway, glad you were saying something. I was uh, gonna say I have a friend who plays a lot of uh, like now, map games, like Dragon Hearts of Iron, and they I know jack shit about geography. Um, oh, this like is gives, gives them a map from like the 1800s of Africa, Russia. and they probably won't be able to tell the difference. <laughs> they thought Czechoslovakia was an island off the coast of Brazil. <laughs> <laughs> and another quote from them is, I only know three states in America, Florida, Texas, and Los Angeles. <laughs> Not even New York? <laughs> Not even New York? <laughs> It's probably not a state to them. <laughs> they just think it's a city. You know, like everyone else in the United States. Even though that person isn't from the United States. I think they're from Australia, right? Yes, they are from yes. Australia. Wait, does this mean that the Australians have a worse sense of geography than us? Probably. I think so. Uh, it's too small of a sample size. Clearly, we need to amass a survey of Australians to figure out who's actually worse at geography. Dang and Robo 5. Who? I don't even know some of the context for the quotes I've said. It's okay. Carbon, that don't worry. Be. I about that work right. today. And I can guarantee you that if we go through the list of quotes, I won't be able to remember half of them either. Apparently, at one point, I said I just tried milking myself. What the fuck? <laughs> oh, that yeah. was uh, Dirty Valley. You, oh. you, uh. Yeah, <laughs> I clicked on myself on accident. Quote unquote, I just tried milking myself. Gladly. Followed by, oh yeah, the sheer force of milk. Carbon. <laughs> That reminds me, Carbon. I thought about you at work today. I had the Slavic island. Uh, I had to use Russia. Paper 
<laughs> and then why, I remember we... about looting a paperclip. Oh, oh, right. Uh, what? I undressed a paperclip once to uh, use as a stim key. <laughs> That's lewd. Wait, why are we using so Why are I we said, rushing to be a blockbuster? At one point, apparently, I said I. I hope I get to see Obama's nuts. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I remember that happening. I remember that happening, and that is all the context. That quote is all the context we ever had. <laughs> Obama's balls probably look like milk duds. <laughs> My nipples look like milk duds! War crimes are just military cringe compilations. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> Arm of three. I still have this one where Water Gentleman and I talked about um, potatoes versus sticks. <laughs> Hold on, can I bring up another quote from Stardew Valley? Sure. Stop touching cow boobs. Eat cow ass. Cloudy. Well, bruh. Okay. <laughs> what the fuck is the cop? Ah, why did I, I say don't know. that? I think Rose you were advocating for the cop. You got the U-235. Jesus was a hot pocket. What? <laughs> <laughs> yep. Oh, yeah, that's right. That conversation. I do remember the context for that. Ah. Is that ass rifle or seed board? Oh, Rose, <laughs> <laughs> you want something? I got flashed far clock. <laughs> Why are we talking about safe and effective ways to shotgun ball? <laughs> yes, I'm saying you need to edge your porridge. to sit there in silence all the time? I just couldn't do it. <laughs> These are the most. I struggle staying quiet for close. even a minute. It's gotta be psych. Well, so what's the right? point in having all that power I... and using it? That I might have been what it used to be. I actually. On bit, Hold up. No, no, actually, um. In this, in the quotes channel of of the of the server that we're referencing, it's not. But in this server's quotes, probably. I accidentally what? ate soap, and then Psych replied with, "Accidentally? You don't mean? You mean you didn't get paid ten dollars?" <laughs> what? <laughs> oh God, the rain old beads. I forgot I had this one. Uh, it was one that Carbon said. Just a that's just a browser with legs. So, funny thing about this shout uh so when you're a kaji and you use the shout it, you're supposed to say world but when you're a kaji it just sounds like you're saying <laughs> 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 Dash skip. Psych, why do you why have you? six hours in your playlist devoted to Shovel Knight Planes of Passage? Wario practicing jihad. <laughs> okay, so right here, you're supposed to use the whirlwind sprint shout to get through this gate before it closes. Here's how you're supposed to do it, as an example. Damn it. You just run through. Oh my god! Yes! Yes! <laughs> it just works! <laughs> that is, that is incredible. I thought it was this easy for everyone. Well, it didn't fix everything. Everything. <laughs> 
Things are still super fucking busted. We'll be Skyrim. Retrieve the horn of Jorgen Windcaller, our founder, from his tomb. Oh, Jesus Christ. Remain true to the way of the voice. What's on the other side of the gate, anyway? Nothing! It was just a test! Why are you standing like that, Sophia? Unrelenting horse shouts, tallest mountain in Skyrim. That counts as standing? I don't like I'm thinking. <laughs> we should fetch our good friend Lydia and show her the view. And at the same time, show her <laughs> Oh god, shouts. here's a quote. So I've come to the conclusion that I've turned a terrible weapon into a terrifying weapon. A full auto hey, iron gear. Except the gun. Wanna play motherfucking triple triad? Yes. <laughs> Sorry. I, I actually saw a video of a fully automatic 50 action express desert eagle. That's not okay. Oh wow. Well. If my brain, if my dead brain is understanding that correctly, that's a full auto penis gun. <laughs> It had a fucking foregrip on it. I found the video. <laughs> I'm not seeing what a way to hell? win here. Yeah, I what don't know what this? your plan was. What is this called? Monkey? It had to have been. I have a boomerang, but that's not as fun as tossing the cat. Yeah, I don't think I have enough good cards for uh, to beat this guy. Dang. Damn. So I'll come I'm back. Sorry. I'll come back. Also, I apologize for flooding the entire conversation with stuff from the quotes oh. section. It's fine. I was looking through some of my own quotes that I've got, and I have one from Water Gemlin that only says Dick Duck, and I don't remember the context <laughs> behind that one. And, and it was, and it was like... Quacked once. And the what, what did I say once? That bunny just quacked. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I have one that says the carbon now identifies as a trans carrot. Bleach and breach. Some random person on Discord, apparently. Is it the fucking <laughs> mono of a depressed SWAT officer? The fuck? <laughs> <laughs> That's a gaman if you want a horse. Or Catla if you're looking for work. Oh right, I don't have a horse anymore. Well, that's added to quotes. What, I don't have a horse anymore? <laughs> no. <laughs> oh, god damn it. Get out of here, dragon. We don't want you here. No scalies allowed. Oh, I was fucking playing Leopard Ed 2. Uh, this is, this is happening over the course of like two or three weeks. But... I was playing with a friend a couple weeks back, and we got to dead center, the atrium, the mall with the fucking race car, and Coach fell from the third story for some reason, just like completely missing the stairs. And I hear him scream, I hear him get around, I see his fucking gun fly off in some random direction. So we go get the defibrillator, revive him, he goes up the stairs, and does it again with the same exact scream. And then a few days ago, I was testing out mods on the same map, and Coach did the same thing in the same spot in the same situation. <laughs> what the fuck? Carbon, I don't know the context of this quote, but... <laughs> Guys, we have to stop the Nazis before they get a sick-ass man. Oh yeah, uh... Keep Europeans contend? <laughs> You're telling me they don't erupt in flames when exposed to the sun? That's what I thought. That's a reference to- There uh, we go! I never would have believed it if I had not seen it. Uh... Uh, basically I was quoting somebody who was, uh, trying to interpret, uh... Uh scene from uh lego indiana jones ah is that where the quote above it teach me how to speak nazi 
No. I don't know what that is. And now this giant fucking dragon skeleton is blocking the way to solitude. Good luck with that, guys. <laughs> Fuck off. <clears throat> A mogus? You can't touch me, but you can touch yourself. That's a bit sussy. What? Nice. It's accurate. Among Us medkit. I have a Sans medkit. Among okay. Us drip tank. The Among Us tank it sounds uh, sus. flaps Taco it Bell. Yeah, it, it's hip to fuck bees tops uh, Among Us drip uh, for the tank, honestly. Honestly, I think the funniest fucking workshop mod is the Bazinga one. Bazinga. Oh, yeah, it replaces it's every the... single, every texture in the game is replaced with bazinga. <laughs> Just like the word bazinga. It's like, yeah, uh, it's a picture it's... of Sheldon's face and the word bazinga. I'm going to download that mod. <laughs> Hold on. Are you? Uh... It replaces every texture in the game. It's like oh, everything. Ah. <laughs> uh... I don't want to get rid of, uh, wait, every texture, so it doesn't get rid of sounds. There's one that gets rid of sounds, but that's optional. Okay, well, I'm keeping, uh, Big Smoke screaming as, uh, as one of them. One of the thing. Okay, who has uh, thalassophobia? You do. That me. Am I the only one? one? I have no idea what kind of phobia that is. Fear of the abyss. Oh, uh, look, no. I have some mechanophobia. All right, there was that time when we streamed hentai. What? I love There's been multiple times we've streamed hentai. Oh, not to YouTube. Okay. <laughs> Context! If I had streamed hentai to YouTube, I would have been fucking banned. <laughs> Context, Heinkel. No, no, Alex is just funny because whenever he sees a, uh, a spitter, he just screams, That loogie dude! <laughs> At the top of his fucking lungs, and it's great. <laughs> it sounds what? like it. What the? Did you guys see that? I, I did see that. What the fuck? <laughs> I don't know. Wow, he didn't even put up a fight. Literally, he just dropped over dead. Good cards. Sweet roll. Yeah. Hmm. So, okay, fun fact about Ash Piles. They don't despawn. Oh. They never really? despawn. Uh, so what exactly is important about Ash Piles? Uh, they are the leftovers of, uh, re uh, revived corpses. Oh. So why is it important that they don't despawn? Because eventually they build up. Oh? Say you have a companion who likes to use, uh, necromancy. Like, um, uh, Serana from the, uh... Dawn Guard DLC. So yeah, eventually it just builds up and then your game crashes on a regular basis. Okay, level with me. What the fuck is a blue raspberry? Uh, it's uh, a so, raspberry, it's, but blue. It's okay, a fake, blue it's blue a fake blue flavor blue that doesn't blue. exist in real life. Yeah, and they're uh, both yeah, I now know the answer to this question. But it's just, at the time, I was just like, okay, what the fuck does blue taste like? It's because everyone who tasted orange wanted to know what blue was like. So they created the blue raspberry. Uh, it's one of many fantasy flavors, which is a very interesting topic that you should definitely look into. Oh yeah, it's a really neat topic. Fucking right in the eye, goddamn. <laughs> the eyeball. Talk about eyeballing it. 
Oh. Well, uh, because we've been brought up, because we've brought up fantasy flavors, uh, is anyone here familiar with the eight levels of Yankee Candle abstraction? <laughs> yes, I, I do remember that. I'm I unaware of this topic. Aware of that one. Ah, yes, the legendary Minecraft version. Oh, I remember that. But anyways, back to candles. Uh, basically, uh, uh, candle scents have levels of of abstraction where the uh, scent is less and less real. Like, it starts off with, this is the smell of cherries, and ends with, uh, this is what dreams smell like. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to Seaside Boardwalk. Yo, that's a that's a good uh that that's a good um uh that's a good monopoly space. Mm-hmm. Seaside boardwalk, uh autumn sunset. Yeah, what the fuck does a sunset smell like? Cold. Don't feel like soaked. Fire. I'm sure it would have a smell if we could smell the fucking sun, but uh... burning metal. Yeah, probably. Actually, uh, I think there was a thing. There was a, a chart, a graph. There was, it was, nah, fuck, I can't remember. It was a statistic of um, all the people. The uh, Yankee Candle complaints and the rise of COVID. Interesting. And every time that. There was a, a spike in COVID. Infection. Yo, I got a Jamora Lord card. Hell yeah. That'll help. Every time there was a rise in, affection, in, in infections, uh, there would also be a rise in complaints to Yankee Candle about the candles not smelling like anything. <laughs> Are you guys noticing the super intense music of the for the battle that isn't like, happening? Yep. E. I don't hear it. I should probably turn up my mic. Yeah, uh... That's an idea. Your game volume doesn't translate to us. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah. it no. never has. It, well, it's just a card to be the Don't worry, that means we can just add in, uh... whatever other music. Uh, uh the... The end video does get uh, the game audio very quietly, but because everyone else in the video is very quiet, uh, it, it balances itself out. I see. Maybe I should turn that up. Cause like I made it so that like um, on OBS it didn't uh, redline. So what the hell is that? What is it? Tiny chest. Like the tiniest. Tiny mimic. See, there's a mini mimic. Mini mimic. He's a micro mimic. Mini muffins, mini muffins. Crab people, crab. No, the Mick motherfucker. <laughs> Have you guys seen muffin films? No. Oh my god, huh? that was my childhood. Muffin films? Muffin films. I have not. Everyone watching this video and the people who are in this video, watch Muffin Films. It was my childhood. Understood. The, Let me find there like a whole uh, franchise of... Oh. Of what? Wasn't there a whole franchise and parodying that were spoofing? Uh, common movies by using thumb puppets and uh, CGI annoying orange style. Possibly. I don't know what you're talking about, but that might have existed. I don't know. Um, do you guys remember when Cartoon Network uh, had a show called uh, Making Fiends? Yes. Sounds familiar. The same I'm person... Perplexed. The same person who made Making Fiends is the person who made Muffin Films. Making Fiends was originally a internet um, show that got translated, that got either bought or translated to uh, television. 
I'm just glad someone else remembers uh, making fiends because whenever else I talk about it, uh, people just act like it never existed. Yeah, like I made uh, it all up. She she made uh, three different sort of like web series that I remember. Uh, it was Making Fiends, uh, uh, Muffin Films, and Big Bunny. Uh, Big Bunny was about a, a giant rabbit that was trying to eat children. Speaking of muffins, my mother um, used to make what we called ham uh, cheeseburger muffins. That's a new one. I'm they were very you good. Up a cheeseburger, essentially, or at least all the components of a cheeseburger, and put it into the muffin. Pretty much. I mean, it was like. Um, cause she made like the muffin batter, and then she put the meat and cheese in it. That's weird. And then baked it. It was really good. Like. Yeah, it sounds like it. Could be, it sounds like it should be good. Yeah. Sweet and salty. It, it sweet is. and savory. I want to go try that. But... Oh. Except I can't my... because of wheat. Mm -hmm. Dang it. I mean, I could see if my mom has the recipe because there should be a way you could use um, wheat-free. Better. Just oh, right. I should fix that. What? Um, so there's gonna be, um, traps here that, uh, cause fire deaths to appear from underneath you. So I need light foot so that I don't set those off. Yeah, I fucking loved Muffin Films and the rest of her stuff. I forget exactly what her name was. Psych, could you jog my memory? What the creator's name was? Amy Winfrey, yeah. Yep, that's her name. But yeah, uh, my favorite out of all of them was definitely um, Muffin Films. My aunt showed them to me when we were kids. That, like, goes back to new ground stuff. Yeah, it, yeah same sort of generation of internet videos. Except with Newgrounds, uh, it was a lot less pure than the Muffin Films and stuff that a Amy uh, did. Yeah. <laughs> pure wholesome content. Ah uh, yes, pure wholesome, pure wholesome con uh, Get him, boy. content. Get boy. A big, a big bunny that tries to eat children. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Sophia's trying to set yeah, the fire. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She set off the fire herself. She deliberately shot a firebolt into the oil. So that was planned. That was 100% premeditated. Like, there was strategy there, but it wasn't good strategy. First, she took was calculated, but man, was she bad at math. Yeah, well, man, she was she bad at math. Uh, I love that joke. Well, that quote, Eastern oh, Iron. Yeah, that's a wonderful quote. It describes my entire existence. My cap, my strategy was calculated, but man, am I bad at math! <laughs> my goddamn. Okay, I, I mean, okay, maybe not my entire existence. My story writing existence is like the pure opposite. I made zero calculation, but apparently I'm great at math. <laughs> You're apparently good at winging it. When it comes to, like, everything else, man, am I bad at math. So, I'm gonna let these skeletons down here have fun with Mr. Wolfo. Nice. Oh god! Ooh. I thought you were totally gonna fall on that. I, I almost fell off. Good. Wait for it, and... Woof! Hmm. 
what other uh, things do you guys remember for your childhood that like no one else does? Oh, uh, I don't know. I've never heard uh, of it. Foster's Home for Imaginary Friends. I remember that. That was a good that one. The classic. That's a classic. Yeah. That's one that's like I remember it, but like most people don't. Ow. Um, I don't know. There's part of it now. Another nice. one. Oh, I, I can never remember what it's called, but it's like something into the chalk zone. And it's about this kid who has a magic chalk that you can he can go into the chalkboard, or he can make things like come to life on the chalkboard because of his magic chalk. That does sound interesting, but I can't even remember that one. Uh, I remember that it was a book. There was actually there was a show too. But there was also <laughs> like an animated feature one, I think. Yeah. Um, mine was uh, mine was the Klonoa series until Joe Cat shouted it out, and I went, "Oh, that did Jack exist." Will. I Jackson remember reading about it. Klonoa in a Nintendo Power magazine. <laughs> yeah, Chalk Zone was by Nickelodeon. Uh, the Yakety Yak um, show. Uh, that sounds familiar. There were a lot of a lot of shows around the. Uh... Yakety Yak era went just completely unheard of because they lasted for 10 episodes and got cancelled. Mm. Wow. That's always sad when something's like really good and then they decided to just do one season of it. Um. But yeah, I thought Yakety Yak was just a fever dream that my child brain had come up with for the longest time. <laughs> I know I have something that sounds exactly not not, not okay not not like the 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 yak yak but like that kind of thing where it's just like my brain feels like it just came up with it but I'm almost certain it's not it. I just the problem is I can't remember what it is which doesn't How I feel help about the chalk zone cuz I remember having a dream about it once and then um, when I went looking for it to see if it was actually a real thing, and then I saw it was a TV series that lasted four seasons. Oh, that was another one. Okay, one that m most people don't know. I was a teenage robot. I remember that. No, no, that's. I remember. I pretty remember well the name of that. Yeah, I never watched it, but I remember. I used to watch it a lot, and I loved it. What was it about again? It was about this. It was about a teenage robot. <laughs> yeah, she, it was almost like a Pinocchio thing where she wanted to be a real girl, but she was also like a hero as well. It, it was very interesting. Um, another staple in my childhood would be the Grim Adventures of Billy and Mandy. Fuck yeah! Oh yeah, that's classic. Yeah. Mama say, mama saw, mama kuso, mama say, mama saw, mama kuso. <laughs> uh. I love Grim. I always thought it was funny he was Jamaican. Dragonborn, I need to speak to you urgently. Rent the attic room at the Sleeping Giant Inn in Riverwood, and I'll meet you, a friend. All that for a freaking note? All that for a note. All this way and risk the life for wow. Nothing? The person who wrote that note better start explaining fast. It was the dang... Wow. It was the dang treasure chest, Bethesda. Hand over the mimic. <laughs> Your toes, hand them over. Give me those knees! I need Your some spine, toes. Hand it over. Oh, another staple in my childhood would be um, Powerpuff Girls. Yeah, that makes sense. That is that isn't really one that's uh, that not a lot of people. That ever one's heard well of. known. Yeah, that yeah, one. Oh yeah, now I, I found Shock Zone. 
Yeah, I used to watch Truck Zone. I don't remember much of it. I just remember it was funny. Um, I think I also used to watch The Mighty Bee. Oh, but yeah. My one. There's also uh, Invader Zim, although I don't imagine yes. anybody's forgotten that one. Yeah, no, that's, that one's hard that, to forget. That one's, like, like, impossible to forget. Even if you've never watched it, you know the name. <laughs> I used to watch you it. You better know the name! Fuck what you heard. Okay, I missed something. I definitely missed something. I completely <laughs> forgot about the word wall. I'm a fucking idiot. <laughs> So near the word wall. Is it in the water? That would make sense for a Zorna tunic. Tripod oh, spiderfish. That doesn't look like a tunic, but uh, I mean, hey, it can go somewhere. Yeah, fuck it. I just realized we've been really quiet. I apologize. So it's fine. Just... We've gotten so much other, like, talking in. It's fine if you're a bit quiet now. A few more corpses than are recommended by the FDA. Oh, 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 it's the oh, waterfall hey. shit. Oh, 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 it's mad. I don't even know if this is like in the base game. It did the gamer secret. Nice. Zora Cap can swim underwater without drowning. Water breathing and 30% resistance to frost damage, but 20% weakness to shock damage. The chest. Now we can leave. So, we got through Ustengrav, we got a new shout, and we found a note telling us to go to Riverwood and uh, go to the inn there and order a room. So I think we're going to leave it off there. I've been Pasta Priest. I've been Onyx. I've, I've been, been Psych. And I'm Carbon. See you next time.